Good morning, everybody. Good night. Good day. Whatever time it is, whenever you're watching this. It's uh, 7.30 in the morning for me. Monday morning, we got my girl Hamburger Mary back here. She's a mini English Bulldog. Red her to King Escobar. He is the brother litter mate to my girl Birkin. If you know Birkin. We're on our way to Georgia. So I live in Central Florida, in d -Land, Florida. That's where the Bulldog Farm is located. But I have an amazing doctor clinic that is in Kingston, Georgia, right at the Florida-Georgia State Line. So me and Hamburger Mary are on our way. Um, pretty sure she's gonna be ready for her C-section. She's showing all kinds of signs back here. So we're about an hour out, I think, still. It's a two-hour drive for me. When I get there, the progesterone test her, see where her levels are at, make sure it's low enough, make sure she's really going into labor. But What do y'all think? See the panting? She's not fully nesting, but she's uncomfortable. She's doing the downward doggy stretch. Pushing them babies back in her. Hamburger's ready. I think hamburger's ready, y'all. Just stay tuned. You're going to see some hamburger babies today. It's been a real crazy week. Once in a while, I do puppy contests. I have a lot of viewers that um, they enjoy viewing me, and they would love to have one of my puppies, but it's just not in their budget. My puppies are pretty expensive, and not everybody budgets that kind of money for, for, a, um, for a dog. I understand that. So every once in a while I like to do contests where you can join for a very low fee and it gives um, some of my viewers a chance to win one of my puppies at a low price. I've had a lady win in Kentucky for $56. I've had another lady, I've had a girl just win with one ball for $86. I just delivered that puppy the other day to the Orlando airport. That morning I had to do an insemination on Malibu. I just inseminated Storm last week. So that's two of my Frenchies I just inseminated in the last two weeks. And now here we go, Hamburger Mary babies. So hopefully everything goes smooth. I'm not sure how many are in there. I think two to three. Fingers crossed for four to five. I would be blessed for five. I feel blessed to have five. I feel blessed to have four. But we'll see what's going on. We'll see what's going on, Mary. Mary, hang tight. We almost there, Mary. Give him a little breakfast. Got my coffee. Got some supplies. We're straight. I'm gonna show you guys a couple things what's been going on this week. Update you on what's been going on at the Bulldog Farm. If you don't know, I just recently bought my Bulldog Farm. I bought a property mainly for my dogs big property for my dogs to enjoy, be safe, and have the best quality of life possible. We're a separate building that's going to be an indoor kennel with outdoor runs also to give my dogs the best quality of life possible. It's all going to be state of the art, something like you've never seen before. Um, I already started on a thousand square foot artificial turf puppy play area. We're going to have all kinds of cool features. I'm going to do a bulldog beach. It's going to be really cool. Even my haters, I know some of y'all don't like me. Even my haters, y'all gonna be like, damn. Damn, bro, did that shit. Hit that follow button, y'all. Make sure you subscribe. Follow my TikTok. Follow my IG. Big Bone Bulldogs on IG. Big Bone Bulldogs on TikTok. If you want to email me, Big Bone Bulldogs Gmail. Go to my website, BigBoneBulldogs.com. It's only my YouTube, that is the Bulldog Breeder, and my backup account on my uh, Snapchat. Oh, wait. TikTok. And my backup account on my TikTok is also the Bulldog Breeder. I catch bananas over there a lot. There's a lot of haters that love my beautiful dogs and me living, living my dream. So um, right now I'm actually on my backup account for the next week going live. So always have that one. Big Bone Bulldogs. TikTok. Speed check reported ahead. IG. My main two socials. You can always DM me on my Instagram. It's the easiest way to get a hold of me. Go to the website, BigBumbleDogs.com. I'm about to revamp my website and I'll really step it up. You guys are going to like that. And I'm going to work on doing...
doing some more on my YouTube. I've been slacking on my YouTube because I just got my bulldog farm, so I've been really busy, y'all. But um, I'm going to really start cranking out some vlogs, doing some more of this, just raw shit. And uh, giving you guys more a look in the day of the life. You guys know I don't sugarcoat nothing. I don't cover up nothing. I'm going to show you the fuck ups, my flaws. I'm going to own up to them. And um, I'm going to share them with you so you guys don't have to make the same mistakes. And yeah, hopefully some of you guys turn into um, future clients. I got studs available. If any of y'all got bitches and you're looking for stud service, um, I offer my full mentorship through the entire breeding. Um, and if you were to buy a full rights female off of me, I offer my full mentorship to you. Um, getting into this breeding game and um, not making the mistakes I made. Um, giving you my tips and tricks and giving you access to all my resources that I've established and I've built up over the years. So we'll be getting here soon. We got hamburger, she's paying I think she's ready, y'all. I think she's ready, y'all. I think my burger baby's ready, y'all. Oh, some of the things that's been going on over this last week, and then check out a little sneak peek of what's been going on at the Bulldog Farm. And watch out, because my next vlog is going to be bringing you guys up to date on the Bulldog. you hit that subscribe button because my next vlog will be going more in detail on the construction of me building my bulldog farm so this doctor dr nun he doesn't allow me to videotape or take any pictures um, while he's doing the operation so you won't see mary again until afterwards but in the meantime here i'm gonna show you some clips from some of my french ec sections over the past signs of pre-labor. You see how she's in that praying position, pushing the babies back. Arrived.